Okay, what's happening guys? I, uh, I've got a super, super quick video here for you because uh, this is a product that I've kind of reviewed before. Hang on, I've got one back here. So you guys might remember about a year ago, I reviewed uh, this gimbal right here. This is the Hoem iSteady X and it's a really small, foldable, three axis smartphone gimbal. Great gimbal. I don't really use it much to be honest. And the main reason that I don't use it as often as I should is because it sort of forces me to use the Hoem app if I want to use tracking. You know, the Hoem app's good, but I would rather use the pro mode on the camera of my Samsung Galaxy S10. So Hoem recently sent me a newer version of this gimbal. This is the iSteady V2 AI smartphone gimbal. And outwardly, they look really similar. This is the uh, iSteady X and this is the iSteady V2 AI. Very similar size, just really similar all around. The controls, incredibly similar. They are, yeah, almost identical. I would say that the, the rear arm on the iSteady X is slightly longer, it gives you a little bit more clearance. But the big trick that the iSteady V2 AI has is right here. That's a little camera. Uh, it has an LED light around it, which is another nice feature. But the camera actually allows you to use tracking without having to use Hoem's app. So you can have subject tracking in your native camera app. So essentially you're gonna get the ability to use your front facing or rear facing cameras with full tracking. And you can use the native camera app in your phone, which in my opinion is a better scenario. If I just put this thing in the gimbal and we'll just pretend like I already have my camera open, I'm going to turn the gimbal on. There we go. There's a button right on top here. Um, I'm filming with my rear facing cameras right now, or I will be. So I hit the button on top and it's got a red light and then it's going to have a there we go. So once it flashes, I make the OK symbol with my hand and it is tracking me just using that little sensor at the top of the camera. I took this thing out vlogging and used the ultra wide camera. I'll cut to some of that footage now. Okay, I don't know what I did with my footage from vlogging, uh, but it looked like absolute dog poo. So uh, yeah, I don't know what I did with my settings. So this is uh, just me sitting in my studio as I'm editing here. I've got my Galaxy S10 on the gimbal and the AI tracking turned on. So this is not through the app. This is just done straight up. Let's put it on the tripod so we can really get it going here. So this is just done straight up with AI tracking. So it'll track you up, it'll track you down, track you side to side, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, being able to use the Pro Camera app, shoot HDR 10 plus video, shooting all my focal lengths, it's great. Love this thing. For me, being able to vlog with the ultra wide camera, which depending on the camera, sometimes these other photo apps or video apps that come with these sort of devices, they don't support all the different camera modes that your phone has. So being able to use all of the camera modes, whether it be ultra wide, normal, telephoto, the front facing camera, and not have to worry about using the app and connecting with Bluetooth. Just being able to track using this sensor right here is absolutely fantastic. I'm gonna leave a link below. Uh, the gimbal costs this many dollars. I didn't look it up before I started this video. Very professional, but yeah. Hohem, thank you so much for sending me this gimbal. I am actually gonna use this one more often than the other one. Also a great gimbal. Uh, less money, but it doesn't have the AI tracking. So uh, that's kind of all I'm going to say about it. If you want to see some of the special modes and stuff, I'm going to link below the review I did of this gimbal because it's got like the inception mode and time lapse stuff and whatever. This gimbal has all that same stuff, basically very, very similar features, but this AI sensor here are added features over the iSteady X, and uh, honestly, they're pretty cool, especially that 
AI sensor. Really, really cool to be able to track yourself and use your regular camera app. So thanks again, Hoem iSteady V2 AI smartphone gimbal. Um, yeah, it's great. Check it out. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.